And that's why there's this bubbles in stocks and bubbles in real estate and all this. People are dumping the cash. Because as I said in here, savers are losers and cash is trash. And yet people are, well, I want a high paying job. Well, that's an obsolete idea. Get out of debt is an obsolete idea. You should learn how to get into debt, how to use debt to get rich. And they'll never teach you about taxes. The reason the 1% is way up here and the 99% are going this way is because when you print money, two things happen, inflation and taxes. It's crushing them. And any entrepreneur thinks, I'm just gonna make money, I'm gonna start a business and make a lot of money because that we talk about, they really have got to smell the roses, man. You know, that's not what the real entrepreneurs are doing. Most entrepreneurs, there's 28 million small business owners mm -hmm. in America. Mm -hmm. 24 million are, are, are what are one person entrepreneurs. They're called non-employee entrepreneurs. So the, because, and that's what happens is when people don't really understand what an entrepreneur does. So most big people are self-employed, but they're not really entrepreneurs. The self-employed pay the highest taxes of all, and nobody tells them that. Yeah, it, it's also called the entrepreneurial spirit, mm -hmm. but what, what we were actually talking about was there's no such thing as a bad economy. You know, there's the external, you and I, we all have an external economy, but we also have an internal economy, mm -hmm. and the willpower is to change our internal economy. So for me, I can see the good and I can see the bad, I don't really give a damn because I'm gonna be rich anyway. But a poor person with a poor personal economy, all they're gonna see is a bad economy because they don't know how to make money in any economy. And a middle class person, they have a middle class economy. You know, they, what they want is a nice house, a steady paycheck, and the job, and the car. And so when you take their job away to them, that's disaster. Well, since an entrepreneur doesn't have a job anyway, it's no big deal. So all I'm saying to people, and it's what Bucky Fuller taught me, is always two sides, you know what I mean? You know, to use plural, at minimum two. So if you think the economy is bad, it's because your economy is bad. If you think that steady, you know, employment is important, then you'll see an, an, an economy without jobs. Your economy. Your economy versus the external economy. Where you control versus where you can't control. I can control.